Welcome to Tech Brothers with Ahmed. Today we are going to answer this question. If your package is scheduled to run every night at 10 p.m. and the package fails in production, where will you begin your search for the error details? So uh, for answering this question, I will not jump in into straightforward and say, okay, I will start looking into the errors and uh, I will uh, start looking into the job uh, view history and all those kind of things. I will start something like this. I will say when I, whenever I design my SSIS packages or uh, develop my SSIS packages, I always enable logging in SSIS package. So uh, most of the time I enable a text for login or SQL server, depending on the company standard standards or the requirement uh, they, they, they follow and next uh, I always uh, uh, put uh, send mail task or um, um, use execute SQL task and uh, that if the package fails uh, that send the email to the DBA team or production support team and also copy you know the ETL theme so that's that's the two thing I always make sure so that's the very first thing if my package fails whatever I have designed and that's I recommend in the company if I start working so enable login and uh, have send mail task in the SSIS package uh, so, so we can get the error code error detail and the, the source uh, uh, source name on that can be any task name uh, on which the package failed so I recommend that uh, to enable that in all of the packages and that's how I start looking I get the email and uh, the, you know that start from there uh, if uh, error um, doesn't give me whole lot information I go into the log files and start uh, looking into the log information and uh, that, that's how I track down also uh, if a SQL server agent job is running your SSIS packages, uh, the DBS can um, set up uh, um, the alert or email from those jobs. If job fails, they can send an email with the error information, whatever the error happened, that will be also captured in the um, SQL server agent job and uh, we can always uh, go manually and check in the history as well but uh, email can be set up on the job levels as well so my my, my answer for this uh, question is uh, telling them I'm well aware of uh, using logging and SSIS I'm well aware of uh, capturing uh, the error information from SSIS packages and send by using the uh, send mail task or execute SQL task by using uh, uh, DB send mail thanks very much for watching this video and I will see you in next video